オリーブ。What are you doing? Hello, everyone, and welcome to another showcase video. Today, I am going to be showing off this very cool puppet that I have done of Miss Circle from Fundamental Paper Education. Uh, so, yeah. So, I actually started working on her before I started working on my jacks. But the reason why I did my, uh, the reason why jacks finished first is because I was waiting for these, like, uh, Brads or whatever they're called. Apparently they're called Brads. I have no idea why, but I was waiting for them to come in, and she was basically like 99% done. And then they came in. I just put the put them in, and uh, yeah, now she's a formal puppet. So uh, yeah, here's a、uh, here she is. Her head can move. Her entire body can move basically. Can do this. Wee. And her、uh, her arm. Look at that! Isn't that cool? And then she has her like a、uh, weapon or pencils or whatever they are. It's just I saw the video and I'm like, oh,、well, that's cool. And then I just like really became obsessed with the design. You could probably tell because if you're watching,、um, as this video turn comes out, I changed my profile picture a lot. But currently, my profile picture is Miss Circle. I did a speed draw of Miss Circle, and now I did this of Miss Circle. Yeah, that's all within a few days. And if you are wondering what she's made out of, it's a paper, cardboard, and sharpie. That's basically it. And also these like brads, or you know, they're like those things where like you put it in the paper and then you like spread them out, and then uh, they can move. But yeah, specifically the card. But the cardboard I use specifically for this is very thin. So I guess if you are going to try and do this, I suggest trying to get thinner cardboard. I use cardboard for a lot of stuff, like the haunted mask and Goosebumps plush, because that's really like the best,、uh, best example. On、oh, also the、um, Dialeus mask for Sonic Plush Adventures, I use like a lot of cardboard for stuff. Just to like change the way plushies look and stuff, but now I've made a full-on character using cardboard. Gonna, she was gonna be just cardboard and like not really be able to move.、But、I was like, you know, what if I try and get those like paper craft things that I don't know the name of, and then, you know, make her movable, so she can be、uh, used in videos and stuff. I will say this: I do already have a video idea with her, so、uh, stay tuned. And just like the showcase of the Jax plush, I am now going to show photos so you、uh, will know how I、uh, made her. In case if you、uh, want to make your own thing like this. So yeah, here we go. There's a lot less photos than last time, just because you know she was a bit easier to make. So first, I just got paper and basically just drew everything, mainly just with the body. I actually.、Uh, I made the body a bit too big, so I had to do the legs on a separate piece of paper. But, eh. And, I, and after that, I cut them out and then used double-sided tape, taped them to cardboard, and then cut them out of the cardboard. Hopefully, the photos kind of make sense, but you can basically see what I did. I just cut around the cardboard. You know, luckily, Miss Paper was pretty easy because if you don't know. Basically, all the characters kind of have a white outline around them, so I didn't have to make it exact. So, yeah, kind of easy. And of course, of course, I had all the pieces together, and I ordered the brads. And as I was waiting for them, I decided to start working on a plushie. I'm like, you know what? This will probably be a project that I'll complete in a few weeks or so. Nah, I, I completed it within like a day. Less than a day. I'll, I'll link the Jack Showcase video at the end of this video in case if you want to see it. But yeah, I literally finished him in less than 24 hours, which I have no idea how I did, but I did it, and I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> and then the Brads came, and then I put the Brads in, and、uh, yeah, now she can、uh, 
She can groove. Yippee! I was originally going to make the legs be able to move as well, but I was thinking with like her standing or whatever, I'd probably mess her up and make her fall over and stuff. I didn't want that. But, but yeah, that's the Miss Circle custom puppet showcase. I hope you uh, like it, and you will see her in video soon. Yeah, since I ordered the Brads, they came in like a pack of 100, so I'm definitely going to be making more puppets like this in the future, and more plushies as well. Uh, so uh, if you want to, uh, you know, be there for when that happens, make sure to subscribe. And, uh... Bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Yeah, 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 yeah.